Alrighty then, now that we have the Soma Cube assembled, we are going to go and create an exploded view in animation, and then we're going to start doing um, some dimensioning. Uh, so to do an exploded view, we go to animation, and there's two ways to do this. The first way, and I never know if it's going to go well or not, is we select the whole thing like that, and we go up here to transform and explode all levels, and we see how it looks. Um, and it doesn't look good. I don't like it. Uh, so for me, that did not work out. So I'm going to hit cancel. Okay, so now, uh, the key to an exploded view is you kind of want all the pieces to kind of pop apart, like an IKEA style thing. So we're going to do transform components. And you just grab a component, and we do want to see the lines trailing. Uh, and all we're going to do is kind of move the part away from the center. So this is a very easy thing to do. One, two. Um, we're going to say, oh, oh, let's get this back in here. I'm going to have this one come out. I don't want to block any piece with any other piece. Put a, a trail here, get this one out. Okay. This one can go up. So I'm going up here. And then this one can go out as well, and maybe over a little. Out a little, over a little, and out a little. Okay, so this is an exploded view. All the parts are exploded. Um, and it's a fairly quick one. I mean, we don't drag it out long. It actually makes a little animation down here that you could watch. Um, and there's lots of ways to do this that you could play with. So, like, if we played it, it just kind of goes exploded view. And then we can kind of make it, like, a big thing. Um, so you can do it like that, or you can kind of play around with this. You can stretch out how long certain pieces take to explode. So like if we go here, we can go like, oh, this one takes a really long time to explode. Or you can do a thing like uh, select at each individual level how far you want it to explode. So if we could do something like this, where you do one piece at a time all of them okay. so I could do it like this where you know all my pieces start to come out one at a time and you kind of see it so uh, that kind of looks better um, but this is what we're going to need basically for our final drawing so this was the minimum this is unimportant this is what we're going to need uh, when I go to grade you uh, and you can see I got some sketch planes up here. I can actually go back into the drawing and probably get rid of those. Like, I don't know what's up with that. Um, so, like, if I just go in here and I turn the sketches off, make sure all of the sketches are off on these. Uh, those will probably go away. I don't know why they're visible right now. And I'm just going through every level because I'm not sure which ones are totally visible and I could turn the joints off too because I think that looks like poo poo. Okay, so now when I go back to animation, I think those sketches will go away and they did, so that is good. Uh, so that's how you do an animation and make an exploded view. Hope this was helpful. Uh, next video, I'm gonna show you how to do the dimensioning.